Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing well. And uh, if you tuned in for the last Hyundai 30N video, you would uh, know Lewis, uh, who owns this lovely car, or that lovely car that we've done before. Um, but I'm now taking Lewis out in my ST200 to get his reaction on it, kind of see what he thinks to it as well. Yes, first, uh, first one I've been in. I've never been in a... ST? In a, yeah, any kind of ST, or even a ZTEC S or anything, but sorry. Scott's, it's got tyres, wheels and an engine. Well, wheels and an engine. Sport mode, yeah. So the traction is a bit off on it if you want yeah, it, yeah. but but no, it's definitely a, definitely it's been a fun little car. It's quick, isn't it? Yeah, it's quick. It's quicker than I thought it was going to be actually. To be honest, I don't really like. My honest feeling that is it's quicker than I thought it was going to be. Like, well, they're one six turbo. Aren't they? Yeah. yeah. There's a big fan base for them, so there's parts, isn't there? Yeah. Like, there's, you know, there's a, a lot of, a lot of different variants of the Fiesta, which a lot of people still, a lot of people still drive the Mark Six ST. Um, luckily, I managed to get this at a really, really good rate. Uh, no, but still don't know whether to keep it or not. It's one of them things. Yeah, yeah people re re reckon it's going to be a future classic. So it's a, a it's, tough it's, one. Yeah, it's a, it's a, I mean, it's, it's like moving a Honda though, you know. I'd like to think I'd keep it and wait until the warranty runs out, put a bigger turbo, this, that and the other. In reality, yeah, exactly. when, I, when the warranty run out, I'm going to be well, 29, so I'm 25 now, so I'm going to be 30 even. Um, so, you know, I probably will sound a bit bigger by then, you know. Yeah, folks are rest or something like that. Yeah, that's it. Well, I was thinking more of Seats, the seats are nice, they're comfortable, they're, they're firm, 
No, but they do hold you in place. He came around that corner like an bit. absolute twit. Yeah, I think, I think he was more on your side than anyone else. He was. <laughs> but they do hold you, man. They hold you in place. Yeah. yeah. No, it's, it, I, I love this car. I prefer, I prefer these seats to the one in, ones in Mark, to be honest. Yeah. yeah they, Bucket seats, they kind of hold you in tight, don't yeah. they? They feel like you're tighter in. Yeah. And now this is, I really do enjoy this. This is uh, probably one of the best big road cars I think you could probably get. For, for, for a bit. Going around here. You can just flick it around here, go back around the same way or whatever. Um, but yeah, this, uh, for, for B roads, I, I don't think there's really a better car than this, to be honest. You know. no, like, no. Well, like the roads we're on now. Yeah, you know, this is the perfect little car. Mine feels a bit wide sometimes, even though it's not. It, it does feel a bit wide, whereas this, you know. You can just... I love the, love the sound it makes. That's a 17 year old when they're coming out. And, and it, sounds quite, it sounds good, doesn't it? Yeah. I, I don't usually drive it this hard. I'm very, I usually drive it very economically, but I never really like, because most of the time my missus is in the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see my missus, she loves it. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When I put my foot down, I've got a smart place to look over there, and I'm just mouth picking it up. No, she absolutely loves it. If this had that kind of, uh, like the suspension mode that you had in the i30, yeah. this would be spot on. Absolutely it's a really good car. It is. It is. It is a really good little car. And you know, you think about the people. This is running stage one. So this is on a stage one remap. But all it, it, it added 15 horsepower. So not too much. No. But it's, um, it's, for what it is, it's quite tuned anyway, really. You know. Yeah. It's it's really like, and stock. These yeah. are really good. Yeah. You know, I think. What What do you feel like with the torque? Do you feel like it puts you back in your seat that much? Is it? It's not overly soggy, but you feel that pull, especially when the turbo kicks it, you feel that little pull and it just, yeah. it, it holds it there, doesn't it? Yeah. For a little engine, it, it does, it kind of holds the torque there. Like, it's good. Yeah, it's nice. I, I really like it. A, I'd have it as, as a little kind of weekend track sort of like, you know. Track car, yeah. Yeah, yeah, this should be absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant, I think. Yeah. All right. Where's our cars? Just behind us. Oh, is it we've gone back? Yeah, yeah. I'll go down there and turn around. Yeah, that's uh, it's a little farm yard here. It does grip, doesn't yeah. it? It's, it's, it's just the way it revs up quite quickly, you know. It's, yeah, it's the yeah. sound of it, it, it makes you want to drive it a bit, kind of. It's got a um, short gear ratio than the <laughs> standard ST, yeah. so it gets up to speed slightly quicker, but that's about it. That's why I was just getting through the gears quick. The people that own um, stage three versions, these running 350 brake. Yeah, I've seen the Voodoo, is it the Voodoo tuned ones? Yeah, oh, you know, it's about 300 odd horsepower. And I'm like, Absolutely crazy. Jesus. Cars, yeah. so, you know, I mean, this is this is quick. What is it, 230? 230. 230 yeah. it, well, it's not even 230, it's 227. Yeah. I mean, this feels quick at, at that, you know, and I wouldn't mind going in a, in a 300 horsepower one. Yeah, that would be absolutely mental, yeah. wouldn't it? I'd like to see how it. How it copes if, if they haven't put a diff in it or something like that, you know, it would definitely need a diff put in it. Yeah. If you really go any higher. And the thing is, these cars take it, they really do take it. Yeah. But it goes up to speed even when you're driving economically. And it, it holds the road quite well. I've got Michelin Pilot Sport 3s on this. How wide are they? Uh, two... Is it 215? Yeah, I can't even remember. Two Have a look. Five, yeah. two, two cars, aren't they? Yeah. Personally, it's a bit too small. Yeah, I'm, I'm six foot two. Um, I like a bit of room, you know. My first car was a Land Rover. That was that was my first car. I rented a Land Rover. Unfortunately, the rest of herself. Yeah, she died. Um, so. Along with the rest of the cars I've owned. Where are we going? Uh, uh, just around the end, yeah. right there. Yeah, so. yeah, I'm quite impressed with this. It's a fun little car. You can see more people is. Really Right, anyway. We're just going to get parked up. But thanks for watching, guys. I hope you in, uh, enjoyed the uh, the drive. And uh, Lewis's reaction. Obviously, it's not... You know, it's 
I, I think, you know, it'd be quite even on speed against yours. Yours feels quicker though. It does feel quicker, tighter. I think it's the way it delivers the power though. Yeah. It's a bigger engine. Quite quite a decent sized tower world. Yeah. You know, so it's, it delivers it. They deliver power in a different way. You know? They do. They, you know, they are. Uh, I think it'll be good. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you give it a massive like. Hit that subscribe button to keep up to date with the uh, latest content that we put out. And uh, I'll catch you next time. And if you want us to do a drag race, let us know. Yeah, let us know. We'll, get it done next time. we'll get it done. Yeah. Awesome. See you later, boys. See you later. See you later. Peace.